Hey, so in this video, I would like to show you some cool nonprofit website templates um, that you can use yourself to build a nonprofit website pretty easily. Um, the first three will be in uh, Divi, so they are WordPress kind of websites, um, which are really nice because it allows you to do a lot of integrations, um, to receive donations, and yeah, a lot of other things. And the other five will be uh, within Squarespace, uh, which is easier to set up. Um, and honestly, they have really nice designs as well. Um, so the first three Divi and the, the other five are Squarespace. Um, I will make sure to link down, uh, to put a link below to all the templates so you can have a look yourself and uh, potentially uh, install them. So the first one, which I think is pretty cool, it's, it's, it's really charity focused, like uh, right above the fold, you see the call to action to donate, like <laughs> it doesn't get any more uh, direct than that. And I mean, if you think about it, I think this is really good because probably the main reason why you want to build a website for your nonprofit is to receive donations. Um, so I think that should indeed be primary. And other than that, um, people will probably be searching for your website to investigate whether you are really legit. So I think it's, it's also good to have like a professional vibe um, because people who will be donating probably will be doing some research to you. So uh, what I really like here is you can embed a video full screen about your nonprofit. Um, yeah, I think this is a, this is a decent, not yeah, not so crazy, um, nice, simple and easy uh, design. Again, here make a donation. Um, yeah, I like it. I like this one. I think it's it's a really decent template. So the next one, um, I mean, this is about adopting a pet. Obviously, you can change texts and completely customize each of these eight templates to whatever kind of nonprofit you're running. Um, but here. Again, like the, the, the call to action buttons to making uh, a donation, I think is really nice. And uh, what I really like here is like the amount of white space. Like whenever you scroll, there's never too, too much text going on, um, which makes the website just really pleasant uh, to browse. Um, yeah, inspiring one. The number three and the final one by Divi. Um, yeah, this is, this is a different kind of kind of design. Like it really depends on what what you prefer. Um, I I really like these kind of animations. I think it's it's pretty yeah it's pretty fun and it gives a really unique um, a unique twist to your uh, nonprofit website. Um, yeah, it's a nice one. Again, I think this is just a decent one. Nothing fancy, but but just just nice. Um, here we go to the first one by Squarespace, and you can see the design is just a little bit different. Like Squarespace they're in a league of, uh, of their own. And what I really like is here, the big make a donation button, which just really draws the attention. Um, I would even opt to have it uh, stick here if you scroll down, like now it disappears if you scroll down. Um, I know that's a setting within Squarespace, which you can um, decide on yourself. So if you install this template, I would probably do that just to make this button visible whenever uh, somebody's visiting your website. Um, but yeah, I, I like this. I like this design a lot. So the next one, again, you can change text here um, to whatever you prefer. Um, but I really like this one because it's again, really clean. Um, you can showcase projects um, or if you're into animals, uh, show the animals you're working with or whatever. Um, but probably show the projects you're working on here, I think is, is, is really nice. Um, it's, a small, it's a small landing page, but I think it does the job. And um, yeah, if you replace this by uh, make a donation or whatever goal you're uh, aiming to achieve with your website. I think, uh, yeah, it, this is a great one. All right, next one. So I like this one because you can put your slogan or your, your tagline here um, combined with an inspiring uh, background image. Then again here, the take action button, which is right there. I would probably make it stick if you scroll down, just like I already mentioned with the previous one. But yeah, this is pretty cool. Um, pretty clean, pretty minimal, but it does the job. Right, next one. So here, I think it's really cool. They have like a full, full-sized uh, background image combined with a, a call to action button right above the fold. Um, as you can see, there's no scrolling, which is, I mean, you have to like it. I, I think it, um, it, it's not good for every type of website. Um, if you're, for example, 
need to explain a lot of things to your visitors before they uh, want to become a member or want to make a donation, I probably would not go for something like this. But if what you're doing is pretty clear to everybody, I mean, this could work really, really well. And actually um, it doesn't really distract people. So you can really try to push them towards the conversion, which could be, you know, make a donation. So yeah, I think there's a lot to say uh, for this kind of design, uh, depending on the, the nonprofit you're uh, running. All right, the final one. Yeah, so again here, you could make a make a donation button here. Um, what I really like about this one is the color scheme, like, and uh, the amount of white space throughout this design is just really nice. Um, yeah, you could potentially add here all the partners you're working with. It's just so super clean, which I think is, is really cool. Um, yeah, so that's it. Um, really nice nonprofit templates. If you don't like these or you like them, but you want to see more, I will make sure to put a link below in the description to more nonprofit template, uh, templates you can use. And I will also make sure to link to these uh, templates so you can have a look yourself. Um, I wish you a really, really nice day and uh, wish you all the best with your website. If you like this video and it was helpful to you, uh, liking this video would help me a lot. So I would already thank you for that in advance. And other than that, I wish you all the best. Bye-bye.